We all know these are geniuses. We call them the king. Someone has challenged us. Someone's challenged our king. We need to make sure that we can land one back on them. It's a tournament as big as it is. I've never fully come in here as as a hundred percent confident. When you said that, I just feel like to give up this this cricket. I really know that he's hurt. If they call you for one game, you can keep playing. If they call you for one more, then you you're banned. This is what we do. This is our job. This is how we provide for our family. बहुत कम लोग होते हैं जो ऐसे उससे निकल के बाहर आते हैं मुश्किलों से और कर पाते हैं दोबारा वो चीज़ जिसके लिए वो जाने जाते हैं तो वो सुनील ने जो करके दिखाया वो काबिल तरीफ है इट वॉज टफ बट आर दी एन वी डे क्रिकेट वॉज नवर ईजी फॉर मी आई हैड वर्क फॉर एवरी थिंग आई हैव सो इट वॉज जस्ट लाइक अनदर अनदर स्टेप इन स्टो नर आई हैव देख डीप वर्क हार एंड कम आउट ऑन टॉप Well, it was a mini auction, and he had put his name in, and we said, you know, if we had to go for one player, who would that be? Sunil Narayan. Get Sunil Narayan. Our conditions to be brilliant. Nobody had heard of him. If you can play for a team that bangs, bangs on you and give you the motivation that you can do it, it's something that you're going to enjoy. Something that you're going to, I think, live for. Sunil has been an integral part of our success. The championships that we have won, he has played a significant role. In. I think life changed drastically. I think expectations of me playing any sort of cricket was very high. We were all upset. The timing of it was. Uh, irritating to be to say the least going through that process was very difficult it's something that could play with your mind if they call you for one game you can keep playing if they call you for one more then you you're banned the little adjustments was very difficult because you could tweak something and it'll work but when you have to tweak about three or four different things in one action you realize how subjective some of these things are when you say 15 degrees and what not how it is tested what happens in a simulated environment was a match situation going into the test that you're not sure if you're going to be playing cricket for a while or being able to play again it's nervous your dad going away at such a crucial juncture right before 2015 uh, I mean and you went back uh, to Caribbean how difficult was that phase for you I mean it was very difficult I didn't think I would have been playing cricket again to be honest but family members say he would have want me to continue so my dad was it was a big role he always said that I'm going to get back there no matter what it takes that he know I have the capability and the mindset of doing it and to me I just had a point to prove trying to be the first one to come back with a remodel action and still do or still have a big role in in back by coaches and Carl was there I think made things easier they were always backing me and telling me that don't worry you're going to pass it us and nothing is going to happen again to his credit there are very few if any who have had to go modify their action come back and be as effective in fact i think he's been even more effective i would say Oh, well, Sunil, tell us how difficult was it, or how much work did you have to put in to remodel your bowling action? I mean, at the, at the start, it was difficult, but I think um, with the help of all my coaches back home and Carl, I think they made it a lot easier. And the motivation from everyone expecting me back was even better. It had days where it was difficult, and you tend to think that something's not right and it's going to go all wrong. But I think there are days in general like that, so you have to take the good days and make it make it better for you then. I'm in love with the waiters for breakfast. Eat my baby for dinner. Had to switch up the methods. We don't hang with pretenders. I'm the five, four, three, two, one. Yeah. Say the city yet again. Here it comes. Yeah. You know, for me, spin's about deception. Deception isn't always about seeing the ball spin hugely from left to right or right to left. It's about what happens in the air and the subtleties of the drop and the drift, the bounce. If you watch the way batsmen play him. Very few leave the crease. 
that don't pick it, and they're not confident about which way the ball's spinning. It's going to take a three, four years to actually get back probably to that peak or that success of your career that you were doing with all action. So just being able to come back and being able to help kick here or do things that the team needs, I think it's, it's all I could ask for. Our home ground got difficult to bowl for any spinner. So it just wasn't me and knowing that I'm, I came back from changing my action, it was even harder. But with the passing of my dad, he always told me that I could be a, a proper batsman. And I set myself a goal in two years time that I'll want to be a rounder and not just a bowler in international cricket again. I'ma need the rings, I'ma go the distance. Do it for my team, just my religion. Because he always said I could bat and he always wanted me to show that I could bat. So on his passing, I made a pledge that I'm going to give it my all for the next two years and see where it, where it goes. And it's working for me at the moment and it's keeping me in the game whether we bat or bowl. Hit him with precision, I don't fucking miss him. Keep him at a distance, I don't fucking miss him. Definitely didn't think that. I mean, putting in the hard work, you just put it in to have successful games, but being able to, to get a trophy like that for, for batting more than bowling, it shows that once you put your mind to it, there's always a possibility that the outcome is there. We all know these are geniuses. We call him the king because his impact on T20 cricket has been significant. He developed the carom ball, he developed all these other deliveries and a lot of people have put a lot of eyes and, and attention on his craft because he's such a genius. King is wounded. When the king is wounded, others have to stand up and perform as well. If you've had a quiet start to the tournament, today is your day to stand up and be counted. Someone has challenged us, someone's challenged our king, we need to make sure that we can land one back on them. That's what I want to see today. King, you're not travelling with, with us to the ground, but we know that you're with us and the boys will stand up for you today. All right? We kind of thought this is behind us, you know, to suddenly hear that he was called was a total bolt from the blue. I've always come in IPL, not it's a tournament as big as it is. I've never fully come in here as as 100% confident the last probably four or five years. And it's something I'm getting accustomed to and something that I've strive on. I've come here, work hard and I've tried to do my best always. Could उस चीज में अपने आप को डाल के देखो आपको लगे कि आप घर से बाहर निकल रहे हो तो कोई आपको देख रहा है तो आपको कैसे लगा यू विल ऑलवेज फील अंडर प्रेशर कि बहुत लोग जो हैं इस चीज से शायद कभी बाहर ही ना आ पाए कि यार मेरी क्रिकेट खत्म हो जाएगी अब क्या करूंगा ऑल ऑफ अ सडन ही इज वन पीस ऑफ पेपर अवे फ्रॉम बीइंग बैन फ्रॉम द टूर्नामेंट दैट्स वेरी डिफिकल्ट ही हैज बीन थ्रू अ लॉट इन हिज करियर ही हैज ओवरकम अ लॉट आई रियली फील इट फॉर हिम व्हेन ही सेड दैट I just feel like to give up this this cricket. I really know that he's hurt. This is what we do. This is our job. This is how we provide for our family. Perhaps maybe the officials hadn't quite understood the ramifications of the decision that they were that they were put down on paper. It had a significant impact on Snell. The resilience that he's shown there is is incredible because the the effect that has mentally on somebody is nasty because it it calls into question his integrity um it calls into question his potential future career i'm not sure what to say about it i really don't want to comment on that because that's that's not me and whatever the umpires or the committee decides it's on them it was tough but at the end of the day cricket was never easy for me i had to work for everything i have so it was just like another another step in stone that i have to dig deep work hard and come out on top the interesting thing i believe is that sunil has developed this new delivery and it is the ability to bowl him run him with his hand behind his back and they'll probably have to wait last minute to see what's really going on so it gives me the upper hand people have said 
we can't play him. <laughs> He's almost too good. Yeah, um, it's something I've been working on years now, so it's not like it's just yesterday I've been working on it. I've always asked batsmen what, what happens if they see, if they don't see. And DK. The mysteries is what gets the batsman a second lay, and you know, that's making, that you made that harder, so automatically it's better. Since the first time he saw it in practice, he was like, when are you going to do it? When are you going to do it? And that was two years ago. So every year he comes, is it this the year, is this the year? And I keep saying, no, it's when the time is right, it's gonna come. So things happen for a reason and I'm pretty pleased with it. Early on in the tournament, Sonny asked, he wanted somebody to bowl at. He asked me, did I fancy batting? I said, absolutely not. I actually feel in good touch. <laughs> you can repeat that every ball, brother. You know, true champions, you know, they always come out strong. I mean, it's tough knowing that games are going on and I'm just bowling and just trying to be ready for the committee to look over. My main purpose was just being able to be ready for when that time comes and they clear it, that I'll be able to, to go out there and perform. And they constituted a very, very credible committee comprising of you know, Rahul Dravid, Javagal Srinath, Hari Haran, who was the ex elite umpire. And they all came to the unanimous conclusion that everything was fine. I was not surprised at all that he was going to go back, work on certain things, and come back stronger. The fact that they put a condition to it that you have to play with half sleeves, did it kind of frustrate you a bit? Yeah, it was a bit annoying at first. But looking at it, I was like, well, probably they think I have something to hide. So I was like, I'll just please them and bowl in a short sleeve rather than go up against them. His role as a bowler is, uh, is worth its weight in gold. KKR made this rough time easier for me, knowing that they backed me 100% in coming back. You know, he's suffered some major setbacks and he's overcome them. And this was just another one continues to be that mystery spinner who is just game after game just churns in performance. Outstanding effort to knock over RCB. Great <laughs> about the star of the show. So now we've got yeah. Ryan. There's not many people in the world that can do that. Okay? Not only can you run over and take David Abilius, Glenn Maxwell and Rat Coley, but you can also bang sixes out of, the, out of the park and put us in a, in a very strong position. So congratulations mate, and you deserve all the accolades that have come your way. And he's come back arguably better. Do that over a long period of time, you're coming up to 10 years since you know, that great year he had. Sometimes it comes to me that the camera will be on me, the camera will be watching me. What if I am called again? There are very few people who come out of the way, and they can do it again. And they can do it again, which they want to go for. So Sunil has shown what he has done, that's a good job. Sunil has been doing it for a long time. There is no other place I like to be than, than Kika. Because I have played all my cricket here, and would love to continue representing this franchise. It's a home away from home, it's my second home, so hopefully it can continue.